Hello and welcome to our virtual tour of our 2016 Toyota Prado GXL. A little bit about us here at Pacific Toyota and Lexus of Cairns though. I am standing at one of two of our pre-owned vehicle yards where we have about 200 vehicles in stock and go through about 160 on any given month. As you can see, we've got quite a variety of vehicles here. Our multi-level showroom in our yard here down in the city. Uh, as you head out of town though, along Mulgrave Road there, you'll actually come across a brand new part of Toyota and Lexus. Parts and services out the back and our second pre-owned vehicle yard just near DFO. Throughout the video though, I'll be going over this Prado in complete detail, simply pointing out any blemishes that may appear that you would be looking for at first point of sale, and obviously any extras on this great vehicle as well. So what we'll do, we'll start on the outside down around the front here. I do like to start with the tyres, as you can see, excellent amount of tyre tread. Looks like they're basically brand new nearly. And being a full drive, just double checking underneath for red dust and rust. And obviously the nice big alloys. Nice and clean and tidy. So throughout the video, we do want to be looking for little imperfections, like little stone chips like these here. So these type of things, you still yet to be brush touched, but that's what I want to be pointing out in this video. Beautiful. So as we can see, it's obviously been fitted with the bull bar here, color coded. We've got a couple of little markings on the bull bar. But the good news is, it's obviously been doing its job properly as we can see around the headlights and the body here. No markings or damages, which is great to see. Beautiful. So around the front end here, bull bar's obviously been doing its job. Very minimal in the actual way of markings, damages, stone chips, those sort of things on the actual body of the vehicle itself. Across the bonnet, nice and straight. No major dings or dents. No ripples in the body. Try and give you a good angle with the lighting there. Beautiful. Down the passenger side, just try to give you another good angle of the body just to make sure it is straight and tidy, but we'll cover each panel as we go. As we notice around the front end there, excellent condition. Bull bar's obviously been doing its job. This vehicle looks like it's been very well looked after. Tie on the front looks like it's brand new as well. And again, just up underneath those wheel arches for you. Beautiful. So as we make our way down the body, uh, obviously you've got your colour-coded side mirrors with the indicators there and the side steps. Obviously being the GXL. As we make our way down, trying to see any dense scratches, stone chips. A little minor imperfection just there. So they're the type of things we'll get brush touched before delivery of the vehicle. But as we can see overall, very good condition down the body there. So on the back wheels, nice solid amount of tread again. Nice and tidy around the alloys and underneath the arches. So around the back end, got a few things to cover back here. So. As you can see, we've been fitted with the uh, rear sensors there, uh, along with obviously the reversing camera up in the spare wheel. Uh, I've also been fitted with the um, Toyota tow bar here as well. But as we can see overall around the back, very straight and tidy. Things like the spare wheel cover there, no markings, damages. Beautiful. While we're back here, we'll also have a look inside for you. Just making sure obviously condition internally is just like the external one so you got a bit of a marking down there uh, but overall quite tidy quite clean no real major damages uh, they've obviously fitted with the rubber uh, floor mat back here so underneath not trying to hide anything that has been looking after their vehicle well we're back here pillar back and show you the back seats Beautiful. So as we have a look down in here, obviously that floor, that one then pops out from the sit on, but as we can see, nice and tidy, no cuts, tears, burns along any of the carpet upholstery back in here. Beautiful. Excellent. We'll now make our way down the driver's side for you. Again, just trying to give you a really good angle of that body, but we'll keep covering each panel as we go. A 
little tiny stone chip imperfection there. So you can see there's a back away, just how small and minor these are. Uh, but they're the type of things we like I said, we'll brush touch and look, look after that for you before delivery of the vehicle. As you can see, good tire tread all around. Nice and clean in the wheel arches. No major damages on any of the uh, alloy wheels. So we make our way down now. Normally it's very common to have markings down inside the driver's door here. Most commonly used door and gets a few knocks. That one's fairly clean. Um, but they're the type of areas we obviously want to be double checking for you. Beautiful. So as we can see externally, there's those couple minor imperfections uh, that can get touched up. But overall, very clean and tidy vehicle. Nice straight body. Uh, no major dings, dents, scratches, anything like that. Uh, no chips or cracks across the windscreen. And on the roof, no major dents or hail damage. Always good to see. And obviously those roof runs uh, being the GXL. Beautiful, we'll now make our way through the rest of the interior, making sure it's just as clean and tidy. Very minimal little wear and tear down on the handle. But overall the door cart's in excellent condition, no scuffing along the bottom, no uh, scratches or tears through, through the door cart. Through the upholstery in here, uh, obviously you've got the rear air conditioning controls. Uh, but overall, upholstery condition, excellent. No stains, cuts, tears, burn marks, hood lining, very clean and tidy. Uh, in the back here as well, also got the rubber mats. Again, just double checking underneath, not trying to hide anything. I've just really been looking after this vehicle as we can tell so far in the video. Beautiful, we'll jump in the driver's seat. So on the driver's door, again, just make sure it's clean and tidy. Obviously you've got all your electric window controls there. Uh, do you get a full set of keys, which is always good. Uh, so simply push button start here. Beautiful, all of our controls for obviously our side mirrors. Now this one here, very helpful. Actually just brings them in nice and tight and tidy. Comes in very handy in those car park situations nowadays. Uh, down underneath though, we've got anything from our idle up, for our sensors, for um, driving lights, all those sort of things. Beautiful, we've got our cruise control on the right hand side of the steering wheel just tucked in there. And all of our controls to obviously answer and decline phone calls once it's been connected. Up here, though, as we can see, it's done 126,544 kilometres. So, genuine kilometres. We'll go through that service history for you shortly. But on the left-hand side of the steering wheel, uh, all the controls for the head unit in regards to, obviously, the volume and changing stations. Uh, the head unit, though, is a nice large display screen here, which is all touchscreen. Built-in GPS there as well. And with that nice large reversing camera displays out the back this great vision in the rear just below there we've got our dual climate control air conditioning setup uh, and a nice decent storage compartment just underneath before we get on down to our four drive controls here uh, like our center diff lock and switches Beautiful. like most nowadays though in the automatic uh, and as we make our way back we've got the 12 volts USB and AUX connections as well with a nice large storage compartment in the center console here. Beautiful, nice deep box in there. But up front, as we can see, we've got the rubber floor mats the whole way through. Very clean and tidy, the upholstery side of things, passenger door cart. Up along all these linings up here, very well looked after. Um, obviously, we've got the dash matter here, so make sure it's not fading, cracking, anything like that, not going sticky. Uh, like I've been saying, it's just really looked after the vehicle. Beautiful, got all of our books in here. Uh, obviously the service is the main one we want to flick through. Beautiful, so full service history in this one from 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 69, 80, 90, 
126, lastly done by us here. Uh, so next one's not due until 137,000 Ks. Beautiful, so not just condition-wise, but also obviously uh, engine-wise, they've really looked after it. So what we'll do last of all is have a look underneath the bonnet while she's still running. Nice and easy with the shocks on the side there. Uh, as you can see, you've got a pocket here for that uh, dual battery if need be. Look at the engine bay, very clean and tidy, no rust, no red dust, nothing like that. In here, running nice and smoothly, there's no major knocks, rattles, squeals, anything at all. Beautiful. So, that was our virtual tour of our 2016 Toyota Prado GXL. I hope you enjoyed and I look forward to hearing from you soon. Thank you.